Hi, I'm Tony Honeycutt, one of the original founders of Premier Amusement Developers, and I'd like to welcome you to our website. I hope you'll stick around for the next couple of minutes because the information that I'm about to share with you is extremely important. It might impact your short-term decisions, and it will definitely impact your long-term business results as a business owner or operator with a new mini golf course, go-kart track, batting cage, or a bumper boat pond. I'm about to tell you the three most important factors that you need to know and understand before selecting an amusement development resource. Naturally, we'd like to be that resource for you. After all, we named our company for a reason. However, this video is really about you. It's about avoiding costly mistakes, and it's about ensuring your long-term success. So keep your eyes on the screen, and let's talk about how to maximize your potential for long-term business success in the amusement industry. Priority number one, plan for success. Everybody's heard the phrase, most businesses don't plan to fail, they fail to plan. That being said, educating yourself is an initial process in planning for success. The first step is to understand your market and its potential. After spending a few hours researching on the web, you can assess your market conditions. Consideration needs to be given to many factors such as demographics, competition, and location. Every entrepreneur should draft a business plan with all the local market information gathered from this research. Some lenders may require a more detailed market feasibility study along with your business plan. After assessing your market, the next critical step is determining the best location. Once the land's been identified, your business plan will progress to a stage that you can start talking with lenders and potential investors. Traditional financing methods, such as an SBA program, have been successful in the industry for many years. Priority number two, effective site selection. As I mentioned before, I can't stress enough the importance of understanding your market. It's critical that you build to your market size. The mix of attractions is directly related to the existing competition or lack thereof. Knowing your direct competition, as well as your indirect competition, will help you determine which attractions to provide for your customers. The results of this analysis will generate not only your amenities, but also it will define the amount of land required. Most FECs require between four to six acres of land. Keep in mind additional consideration needs to be given for future expansion opportunities at your center. Factors for consideration in searching for that perfect location include zoning, access, traffic counts, land configuration, and obviously cost. Priority number three, contractor services. After you've completed all your business planning and site selection, the next logical step is determining who is going to design and build your facility. A visit to your local municipal building department will provide you with important details that are needed in the design stage. Setbacks, easements, floodplains, ingress, egress, and local building codes are some of these issues that can affect the design of your facility. Every construction project requires detailed planning and design. Several professionals may need to be involved in this process. Those including local surveyors, engineer, general contractor, and a specialty contractor. Depending upon the scope of your project, it may be beneficial to use local tradespeople to provide common services such as excavation, site drainage, utilities, landscaping, and fencing. For your feature site attractions, though, like your go-kart track, miniature golf course, and batting cage, a specialty contractor should be utilized. Local contractors have no experience in designing and building go-kart tracks, miniature golf courses, or batting cages. The specialty contractor can assist in project management while assuring timely completion of your construction schedule. In choosing this specialty contractor, you should seek one with a track record of success and a large network of industry resources. Their experience is invaluable. In summary, planning for success requires lots of due diligence. After researching your market and securing your site and funding, the most important decision is who will build your facility. Premier Amusement Developers has over 50 combined years of experience in the amusement industry. Let our experience help you become successful. Take the next couple of minutes to review our website further and to learn about the benefits of using Premier for your project. If you'd like to learn more or have further questions, call us at 423-598-9994. While you're here, please fill out our brief contact form just to the right of this video and we'll promptly follow up and guide you to success in the Family Entertainment Center business. We look forward to hearing from you very soon.